Now from Place Ministries, another inspirational moment. Welcome back to Your Place. Proverbs 22, 6 says, Train up a child in the way he should go, and when he is old, he'll not turn from it. For many years, this verse has been used to give parents hope that they did their part to instill godly principles that their children would not stray away. It's extremely important to instill godly principles, but this is not the original meaning of in the way he should go. It actually means according to his bent. In other words, train up each child according to the unique personality and gifting that God gave him or her at birth. Don't attempt to make children be and become people who do not match their God-given design and their makeup. Max Locadio agrees. In his book entitled Cure for the Common Life, he arrives at a similar principle as he has this to say. Moms and dads face a decision, make our children in our image or release our children to follow their God-given identities. View each child as a book, not to be written, but to be read. Don't see your child as a blank slate awaiting your pen, but as a written book awaiting your study. God gave you an 18-year research project. Ask yourself, your spouse and your friends, what sets this child apart? Childhood tendencies forecast adult abilities. Read them, discern them, affirm them, cheerlead them. So what's the principle for us here today? Simply put, go with the flow whether it's your kids, your spouse, your co-workers, and just importantly yourself. You have to understand that you were made for a purpose. So as you live out your place in life and ministry, spend some time reflecting on your unique bent. Spend some time looking at others that you interact with and spend some time in prayer, thanking the Creator for how He has put you together. And then go and live out your life according to the way He intended you to go. Your Place is a weekday devotional from Place Ministries. Our focus is helping followers of Christ know how and why God created them and be encouraged to do what God created them to do in life and ministry. For a list of free resources, go to placeministries.org. And join us every weekday right here at your place.